Today, we are going to design graphics in Adobe Express for live streaming. We're speaking to small business owners, creators, entrepreneurs, anyone with a product or service. Starting from a template is so much easier. It's my hope that this cuts down the time for you designing in at least half in the templates gallery. It's absolutely incredible. From the canvas, you click over here to templates and it'll pre-populate pretty much anything you could ever want to design, organized by different design types and different themes. We're going to pop in your photo. This is looking awesome. We have your brand set up in Express, and now we really just need to customize your name. I have your brand enabled right now, so that makes it really easy for me to hop in here and choose from the fonts that you've already selected. Mm. Very important here, file type PNG transparent background. If by chance you do not select that, then it's gonna save that background, and we're not gonna see your photo or video in the so no, whatever software we're using for live streaming. Click down download and that's going to download into my downloads folder. There we go. Do you see the little lower third? Oh, that is so right cool. There. You might start with a template. Some of these are not lower thirds per se, but they could easily be modified. Let's work with an existing graphic to create you a new asset for your stream, which could be a starting shortly screen. I just extended this to touch each end of the canvas, right? Justified it, giving us some room over here. Text, let's say the background was white, but I'm kind of going for that seamless type looks. When you're designing or you're building your brand, you may have some pre-existing assets that you want to apply. Maybe they were designed in Photoshop, Illustrator, etc. But then you've also got the ability, if you don't have those pre-selected, you can hop into Express, choose from amazing stock photos. There's a category called backgrounds. I'm just going to click this. If I was I to stretch it. this to add to the background, that would make an awesome background for a stream. I love having this as the background for a live stream. I want to just create some basic shapes that are going to almost be like the backdrop or like the highlighting feature for your profile photo and yeah. for the screen. This is the last shape I'm going to add to this. I'm going to use again because you've got your brand set up in Express. See it right there? Branding basics. You've got your three branding colors up here that made it really easy for me to choose. For this, I'm going to turn off the border. Download button up in the top right, as we know in Express. In this case, we're not saving it with transparent background. I want mm. this background. Click download. And now in a second, you should, if I turn over here, you should see how it looks. You can animate text in Express, but it's going to save it as a video, as an MP4. And that's not going to give you the flexibility to have that overlay effect. It's going to save the full screen with the background built into it. When I enable this layer, this is going to animate it for me by clicking enable and disable. Mm -hmm. This is an Ecamm, so I don't actually need to animate it in Express. I would do it in the software that I'm using, Ecamm, OBS, StreamYard, you name it. And guess what we're going to do for you right now, Annika? We're going to make you a simple intro. I'm going to add some elements to it just to demonstrate what you can do in Adobe Express video. I'm going to use the remove background feature to remove this background. I put you against your beautiful branded, uh, this kind of violet tone that's one of your colors saved in your brands. Click download. We could say this is a PNG or a JPEG. This is very important. This is actually a separate content type in Adobe Express. So you're going to want to follow these instructions closely. Click the plus sign, create new. You're going to select video down here. So we're going to do a live stream intro. Adobe Express is just collecting some information on what it is that you are designing. We're going to make up our own. I chose that last option there. This could be any combination of video, text, photo, or icon. Start with some text. We could do full screen, split screen, caption, title, or text. I'm going to do split screen. It's defaulting to my brand. So we're just going to, in a single click, switch brands. And that's going to enable us to apply your brand instead of mine. They give you three options for brand themes here, light, medium, or dark. I think that looks kind of cool, the medium. I like the idea of adding an icon here. Let's type the keyword live and see what comes up. Oh, these are good. And so this is allowing me to combine text to combine icons or shapes as we saw earlier and we can swap the colors i'm going to go to add a screen here upload that photo that we made of you 
Now it's finally time for video. So you sent me over this awesome MP4. The final thing I wanna show you over here, we looked at the theme. There's others here, so that'll change the colors. So I'm not gonna click on any of those. There's already these predefined uh, themes that look really good. We could also click resize. This is awesome. You know, planning right now for widescreen, this would be on your YouTube Live, like yeah. we are now, or it could be on uh, Twitch, it could be on LinkedIn. You could also adapt this to Square if you wanna put it on Instagram for example. Finally, they actually have some royalty-free music built in that you're able to use. Are you guys ready to see the whole thing in action now? Let's see it. You ready? Adobe Express enables you to preview this. So this gives you those few seconds, right, to get started. There's mm. that stock photo. There's a cute photo of you. And there we go. Love it. Thanks so much. You Bye for too. now. Thank you.